Although DJI has not yet made any formal announcements, signs are increasingly pointing to a major new release by the end of 2025, its first ever mirrorless camera. Hints have surfaced through swiftly deleted social media teasers and credible supply chain leaks, suggesting something substantial is in the works. At the heart of the speculation is a potential hybrid imaging device that marries DJI's technological innovation with Hasselblad's storied optical heritage. Should these rumors prove accurate, the DJI mirrorless camera could make a serious dent in a market traditionally led by Japanese heavyweights like Sony and Canon. DJI's move into the mirrorless camera segment feels less like a surprise and more like a natural progression. Over the past decade, the company has built an impressive reputation for democratizing high-end imaging technology. The Mavic drone series transformed aerial photography by giving everyday users access to professional quality footage. Similarly, the Ronin line of handheld gimbals has become a staple for filmmakers needing smooth, cinematic movement on a budget. DJI's 2017 acquisition of Hasselblad, known for its medium format expertise, only reinforced its aspirations in the professional imaging world. The rumored DJI mirrorless camera could represent the synthesis of all these innovations. Rather than targeting a single niche, the camera appears designed for hybrid creators who demand excellence in both photography and video. According to industry analysts, DJI is likely to focus on flexibility, possibly introducing a modular camera system. This would allow users to adapt the device for different needs, transforming it from a compact walk-around camera into a fully rigged-out cinema tour with accessories like external monitors, grips, or battery extensions. This approach echoes the modular design of the Ronin 4D cinema camera, which has already been embraced by both independent filmmakers and Hollywood productions, such as the upcoming Formula One movie. Hasselblad's legacy is expected to play a key role in shaping the DJI mirrorless camera's image quality. While it's likely that DJI will source the camera sensor from Sony, an industry norm even among top-tier brands, the real differentiator could lie in Hasselblad's proprietary color science and calibration techniques. Hasselblad's work in medium format cameras, especially models like the X2D 100C, suggests that this camera could deliver outstanding tonal gradation and dynamic range, making it especially appealing to photographers who prioritize rich, nuanced color reproduction. Lens compatibility will be another crucial factor. The current rumor is that DJI will adopt the L-mount system, joining a growing alliance that includes Leica, Panasonic, and Sigma. This would give the new camera immediate access to an extensive catalog of over 80 existing lenses, eliminating the need to launch a proprietary lens system from scratch. However, long-term plans may include Hasselblad branded lenses, manufactured under DJI's guidance to blend Swedish optical precision with DJI's mass market efficiency. This dual lens strategy could allow DJI to serve both entry-level and professional segments without fragmenting their product ecosystem. One area where DJI could really leap ahead is in body stabilization. Early leaks indicate that the camera may incorporate a scaled-down version of the Ronin Ford's impressive 4-axis gimbal technology, which combines mechanical stabilization with intelligent AI-driven corrections. If implemented in the mirrorless form factor, this hybrid stabilization could offer handheld results rivaling those achieved with tripods or gimbals. Travel photographers, documentarians, and on-the-go filmmakers would especially benefit from such a system. It could mean no longer needing to lug around bulky stabilizers, giving creators more freedom to shoot wherever and whenever inspiration strikes. Combining traditional sensor shift stabilization with real-time horizon leveling would give DJI a clear edge over competitors, many of whom still rely on more basic stabilization methods. Unlike most mirrorless cameras that begin with photography in mind, the DJI mirrorless camera is expected to take a video-first approach. Rumors suggest it will support 8K video at 30 frames per second and 4K at 120 frames per second, placing it well above many competitors in its class. Additional features aimed at filmmakers may include internal ND filters, waveform monitoring, and focus peaking, tools more commonly found in cinema cameras than in typical mirrorless bodies. One particularly exciting inclusion could be DJI's LiDAR-based autofocus system, originally introduced with the Ronin 4D. Known for its near-instant subject acquisition, LiDAR AF could help address one of the most common frustrations videographers face, unreliable focus tracking. If this tech makes it into the final camera, it could make DJI's offering one of the most accurate and responsive mirrorless systems available for video creators. 
a major strength of DJI lies in its broader product ecosystem, and the mirrorless camera will likely be built with connectivity and integration in mind. Speculation points to real-time wireless communication between the camera and DJI drones, allowing users to use the mirrorless camera's viewfinder or screen to monitor drone footage live. Additionally, pairing with accessories like the DJI Mic 2 would enable automatic audio syncing, simplifying the workflow for vloggers and filmmakers. The company has already demonstrated this kind of integration with products like the Air 3 drone, which streams 4K video directly to smartphones. A similar approach for the DJI mirrorless camera could further streamline media transfers, previews and edits, especially for creators producing short-form content for platforms like TikTok or Instagram Reels. Perhaps the boldest rumor centers around cloud-native features. DJI is reportedly exploring eSIM functionality, allowing the camera to automatically upload raw images and footage to cloud storage, even from remote locations. This would eliminate the need for physical backups and offer immediate content access to editors or collaborators worldwide. Such a feature could be particularly useful for professionals in fields like real estate, surveying, or environmental documentation. When paired with DJI's existing drone mapping technology, the camera could become a powerful tool for commercial photography and data collection. For the DJI mirrorless camera to gain traction in a highly competitive market, pricing will be critical. Industry analysts predict a price range between $2,800 and $3,300, which places it between Sony's popular A7 IV and its flagship A1. This positioning could allow DJI to offer flagship-level innovation, such as modularity and cloud support, at a more accessible price point. To put this in context, the Hasselblad X2D100C currently retails for around $8,200. If DJI can deliver even a portion of Hasselblad's image quality and design at less than half the price, the value proposition becomes very compelling. The target market seems to be hybrid content creators, professionals who want one device for shooting photos, filming 8K video, live streaming, and creating content for social media, all without worrying about overheating, limited battery life, or ecosystem fragmentation. Leaked renders indicate that the DJI mirrorless camera will lean into a premium aesthetic with design cues inspired by Hasselblad. Expect tactile dials, a top-mounted monochrome status display, and a durable magnesium alloy chassis. Reports suggest the user interface will borrow from DJI's drone ecosystem, emphasizing customizable controls over deeply buried menus, making it ideal for users transitioning from smartphones or action cams. Ergonomically, DJI might also break away from the traditional symmetrical grip layout. The Ronin 4D was praised for its offset grip that reduced fatigue during extended shoots, and it's possible the same concept will carry over to the mirrorless model. This would make the camera even more appealing for handheld use in run and gun scenarios. Despite the excitement, DJI still faces some clear hurdles. The most pressing is brand loyalty. Photographers and filmmakers heavily invested in Canon RF or Sony E-mount lenses may be hesitant to switch systems, even with L-mount compatibility. Building confidence in long-term lens and accessory support, possibly through partnerships with third-party brands like Sigma, will be essential. Battery life is another area of concern. Mirrorless cameras already struggle to match DSLRs in power efficiency, and the inclusion of power-hungry features like real-time cloud sync, wireless streaming, and advanced stabilization could worsen the issue. The rumored DJI mirrorless camera isn't just another piece of gear it could signal a new chapter in digital imaging. By fusing Hasselblad's craftsmanship with DJI's innovation and ecosystem, the company is aiming to redefine expectations in a saturated market. Features like modular adaptability, wireless ecosystem integration, advanced stabilization, and intuitive controls could set it apart from anything currently available. But success isn't guaranteed. DJI must prove it can deliver professional-level reliability and long-term support. The pricing must be right, the features must work as promised, and most importantly, the camera must offer real-world value to creators. If it does, this device could become a landmark moment in mirrorless history.